We just woke up. We're sitting here and hiding up from some storms at the moment. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we just want to jump on here before we get into the video. Yeah. And stop! You may not have noticed, you may have noticed, but the last few videos have been a little bit different. You may not have heard from us that much in them, and it's because we've been having some really bad mic issues, and we didn't even realize until we started editing them that our mic was broken, corroded from the salt. So, we had to cover up a lot of it with music and a lot of the footage we lost. <laughs> I think we've got this problem under control. We've learned to check our mic before we start filming. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> And while we've got you here, yeah. our goal, stop! Our goal this year is to try and get to 20,000 subscribers before the end of the year, which is a huge ask. That's going to be tough. I don't actually think it'll happen, but we thought we'd no, set no, the goal. No, 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 don't say that. And it, if you guys can help us with that, that would be amazing. It's a huge help to our channel to help yeah. us grow. So if you'd like what we're doing, please hit the subscribe button and help us get to 20,000. Share with your friends, your mom, your dad, your grandma, your auntie, we'll celebrate, your uncle. We'll celebrate with an Atlantic oh, no. Crossing. Start an account with your dog. <laughs> Enjoy today's video. Oh, tastes like salt. <laughs> There was just so many charter boats in that last anchorage. It was pretty good, but here there's three boats completely open and we got a little island for Jackson to run on. But he's roaring to go. Mate, it's 6 a.m. Come on, Toots. <laughs> you have to tell him how awesome I am. I'm tired. I'm tired, and Ryan wants me to film him jumping into the water for the 15,000th time. Shut up, woman. <laughs> Go! All right, we're going to check on Thor, see how he's holding up. Did you get that? You want me to do it again? Oh, yeah. yeah, I don't want to break the lens. <laughs> Let's find this tanker. head around to the other side of Sardinia today, I reckon. So I just got out of this water because we anchored in three meters last night. We left early through this little passage with the Madalena Islands before the big yachts came out because it's been windy the last few days. It's been like 30, 40 knots. I knew today, like the first day of nice weather, all the boats will be out and we want to get through there before 9 a.m., which we did do. And when I'm looking back at it, there's like hundreds of boats out there now. But when we went through, there was probably about half a dozen. Rather than trying to tack up between here in like 16, 17 knots with all the boats and everything all mixed up, I'd rather just zoom straight through and get the hell out of here. So it actually hasn't been as enjoyable as I thought up here. We're not in a storm. We're in the chop of boat traffic. There's that many boats moving around that the sea is just a mess. Just carnage here. Friend's gonna have to do a sharp turn. Oh, there's another one coming. Holy shit. Woo! Our poor jingy. Literally just for motorboats. Oh. I mean, it is absolutely beautiful and I all recommend people should come here and visit, but like... It's funny though, because like we go to all these cool spots like all other places around Europe. And then you come here and it's like you get settled in Anchorage and it's so crowded and busy, but that's fine. It's like, you know what? It's fine. But then it's like right before sunset, a massive boat comes and anchors like right on top of you. And you're thinking, oh, and you like yell out to, oh, mate, like you're a little bit close, don't you think? And they're like, no, I'll be all right. And you're like, oh, well, uh, oh, I guess we've got insurance. Like, letting them know that, well, if you're here, it's your fault. You're the last one here. Why don't you come right at the very front and try and squash in? Anyway, then he has his generator on. So he squashed in between like a dozen boats, pissing everyone off, then ran his generator all night. 
just like, oh. so it is beautiful, but everything comes at a price, and that's the price. Just can't wait to get around this point and throw the sails out. Well, starting to get a bit hairy. Oh my God, Ryan! <laughs> Woo! Burning no fuels. What's up? Between seven and seven and a half knots. We're going between seven and a half and eight knots earlier. How much longer? 30 minutes. That's our anchorage right in there. Our microphone's been screwing up, so I hope that worked. But it's actually been quite chilly. But Sardinia in general hasn't been that hot. It's been pretty mild. Ryan read that Sicily was 48 degrees the other day, and we're like, well, we're not getting it. Like, I'm in a full blown sweater right now, and it's cold. It's the middle of August. It's supposed to be hot summer. What the hell? I know what you mean. Kisses. <laughs> Coming off as well, buddy, eh? <laughs> We've had a lot of like 30, 40 knot winds across in uh, the Madalena Islands up there. So Thor's really looked after us. And um, it's one of those things that like at the time you're like, yeah, yeah, like the anchor's all right, like getting us by. But then you get a new anchor like this spade. Man, we would have struggled hard this last month. So I don't know, it worked out. Good timing for us for sure. All right, the boats are actually a lot closer than I thought. It must be getting shallow up here pretty quick. So I'm up the sail away and get ready to motor in and anchor. You alright bud? Come on, let's go. Inside, come on. Good boy, come on mate. Are oh, you going to pee first? Uh, alright, let's go. Come on boy. Look at all that dog hair just came off the rope. It's called multitasking. I'm cooking dinner while I pull sails in. Oh. And I'm just awesome. Water is amazing. Such a nice spot. That's it, that's all, mister. You're standing rain from the camp. Come on, let's go. Let's go. So yeah, we decided to stay in this anchorage a little while longer. It's so beautiful. And also we can take the time to get caught up in videos. We're gonna do a catch up with our patrons, have like a live chat so we can have a catch up with them and enjoy ourselves. There's gonna be a bit of a rush to try and make our weather window and we probably end up having to motor for quite a bit of it. So we'll just take our time. Okay, Ryan, come on. I better put my walking shoes on. Jackson, Oh, look at the moon! Look at my chair. <laughs> if 
anybody knows me, they know I'm a geek. And this island has crystals all over it. You're crazy. I came here this morning, all I saw was rats everywhere. <laughs> and I became obsessed with searching for crystals after we were in Albania and I found like huge crystals on a beach. And Ryan thinks I'm like a cave woman because of it. It's a rock. It's a big pink crystal. Far out. I got Jackson running around chasing rats. I got Brittany digging out bloody rocks. Look at this big sucker. So we're still here digging crystals, Jackson's still chasing rats, nothing's changed, it's just my life. <laughs> you know the uh, Yacht Week ads, Brittany, in Croatia? You know, boobs out, drinking beer, like partying. Nah, it's uh, containing your dog from trying to kill a rat and uh, watching your girlfriend dig rocks out of mud. Hey buddy, <laughs> now we've just been setting this up all day. We're doing a Patreon live chat. It's I've exciting. never done a live chat in general. I've never done a live chat either. I'm nervous. What do we say? Because I say stupid things. So how do you think that went? Oh. Hello. I don't know, it's but funny. That it's dark in here. Smells good now. That's mine. Brittany didn't want to cook dinner. She's like, reheat the case of deer. And I've literally had like six case of deers in like no, you 24 you hours. Had I had a case deer yesterday. No, you didn't. You had Mexican chicken on rice. It was the same thing without the case of deer. That's not a case of deer. Save me, people. She's feeding me leftovers like six days straight. And it wasn't why I turned the camera on. I turned the camera on to talk about our chat. Ooh, and it was so cool. It probably went a little longer than everyone probably expected. It went for like an hour and a half. Yeah. We're just talking like heaps of stuff asking questions answering it was so cool i loved it thank you to everyone who joined our chat thank you everyone it was fun it was it was good i talk heaps of shit i feel like i really carried it ryan was boring i try to be mature and serious i wore a shirt i was gonna put the bow tie on so look this is it guys that's a pretty mm. good looking dinner you spoiled shit yeah because i cut it up to look epic now she wants some of my quesadilla the, the point of this was <laughs> if you guys don't know what patreon is it's a great way to support our channel. Thanks guys for everything you all do. Thanks for watching our videos. I'm glad you like them. And thanks to our patrons for jumping on a live chat today. That was epic. We'll do it more often. I can't wait. Get your questions ready. Um, oh, the battery's gone dead. I'll be quick. We're at this uh, anchorage, Della Pelosa, it's called. It's bloody amazing. We've been here for a couple of days now. The weather's been a bit windy. Uh, it was sunny the other day, but we're just working hard on the computer. Just, I don't even think I got outside the boat. Yeah, it's been a bit chilly here too. We're in the middle of summer. What's going on, world? Um, no, but it's Sardinia. It's so, like the only cold place in the Mediterranean. Yeah, it's funny. It gets cold up here with these winds. So now today we're getting about 10 to 15. So we're leaving this morning. You're waiting for your morning walk, eh? It's about 9 o'clock, so he's dying to go for his walk. So we'll take Jackson for a, a run on the beach. We'll get the boat ready. Oh, we're going to go for a quick swim. For some reason, I've got some barnacles on the boat and on the dinghy. So somewhere we've gone is like infested the boat with barnacles. Well, not festive, but I got like, you know, we'll show you that in a minute. So I gotta dive down. The water's bloody freezing. I need shrinkage and you're gonna get bloody torpedo nipples, hey? All right, Jackson, let's go for a run. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Let's go. Hey. Oh, no. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> oh, no. I can't get out of the rock here. Oh, no, I'm about to go over. If we're gonna hit. Oh, oh. There we go, we hit. <laughs> Great old time while we suffer over here. got these noodles that have been in my pantry for so long. They're actually out of date. So I'm gonna make like a stir fry out of this with whatever I've got going on. So let's do this. I may have gone overboard with the chili. My lips are red. Ready? Hey, Brittany's finishing a meal prep. What are you doing there? Crepes. Try out my noodles. Oh. Tell me if they're too spicy. I put too much chili in there. Really? Yeah, it's a, it's a bit chilly. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, they got some kick to them. <laughs> I normally would probably put like shredded cabbage, carrot, onion, <laughs> bunch of random stuff, but I didn't have any, so that's all we get. 
we're going to start off here with this white doddies and we're going to sail uh, da, 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 to Menorca in Spain. We are going to leave next probably hour or so. We'll have it on note, but then when we turn the corner, we'll be close hauled. So you'll see the wind kind of changes a bit, picks up. And then what I usually do, I always check the waves. So if you look at the swell here, it's showing 1.3 meters. Yeah, that's, that's not bad. So it should be sweet. It should take, yeah, about 36 hours, just over. I'll go through, do three hour intervals with the wind, with the swell, with the weather, with the passage and mark it all off. And then we'll try and stick to that best we can. Just by looking, I know there's gonna be times we're gonna be going with six knots, there'll be times we're gonna be going like, you know, three or four knots, so. We've got like, a few patches of um, binnacles and they're right where the rudder is as well. The annoying thing is, is that we actually dropped the rudder and we did redid the rudder bearing. When we did that, I like sanded it back, did like epoxy primer, primer, and the antifoul. I actually did three coats of antifoul. Actually, I think I did four coats of antifoul because I was like, you know what, it's hard to get to that area. So while I've got the rudder out, I'm just gonna like do it properly with international micron, I think it was extra or 350, which is like their top expensive one. I wanted the good one to get us through the Atlantic and everything. I've got barnacles growing on it. Get out and show you. This is our spatula. I use a plastic spatula. That's the tool we use. I think the water's going to be cold here. All right, the wind's just picked up. Now it's time to go to Spain. Ready? Stop eating the potato chips. All right. I hope. Guys, Brit Brittany's just, Brittany. I want to do it my way. I hope you've been liking our videos. <laughs> yeah, God, Jackson's burp. Come yeah, on, got the leg up. Tell him I'm not wearing pants. <laughs> oh, you're not wearing pants. I get it on camera. <laughs> oh, let me just want to say subscribe. Okay, no, just stop. subscribe. <laughs>